earth as a resting place and the mountains as stakes. The Quran indicates that mountains have deep roots mm -hmm. by using the word stakes to describe them. In fact, mountains do have deep roots and the word stakes is an accurate description for them. Mm -hmm. A book titled Earth by geophysicist Frank Press explains that mountains are like stakes. Hmm. But you see, we just showed you that Allah, according to Islam, he placed mountains in the top of the earth. If we go in the Quran, we will see the following. <clears throat> oh boy. <laughs> you know, uh, uh, deception is is uh, is easy to get bust, but if you are naive and you don't have, uh, you know, the knowledge, people they can fool you or, or you know very easy. Actually, already we showed you that Allah He claimed that He placed the mountains in the top of the earth, and the mountain has He firmly fixed. Okay. Uh, if you read the, the Quran, you will see how Allah created the earth here, which is chapter number 79, which is totally contradiction for a chapter 41. Take notes. Chapter 41, it says that Allah created the earth and finished everything in the earth, and then he went to the sky, and then he made the stars. Chapter 41 is the opposite from 79. Here, Allah, he created the sky, and then he came to the earth, and he made the earth flat. And then, you see the translation here, it says, he made the earth uh, uh, extended. If you remember, the Muslims, they say that the Quran says that the earth is like a circle. Remember? They say the word the haha. The fact the word the haha is a flat. They lie about the meaning of this word, and they say it is circle. If you go to the tafsir, this is the chapter 79, verse number 30. All right. My security is high. Give me a second. All right. Chapter 79, verse number 30. You go there, you will find the following. And remember, this is the Muslims explaining the verse, not me. Because the Muslims, they might say, a Christian prince is not being honest with you. Okay, this is their scholars, the highest scholars. This is why this is the official government website of the Kingdom of Jordan. All right? So this is not a Christian prince saying that. This is the, this is them, you know. Okay, hold on. We, we chose the, the wrong verse, sorry. Chapter number, verse number 30. <clears throat> all right do you see it Allah he spread the earth and he made it flat do you see it and it was created before the sky <laughs> do you see it so according to Islam the earth was created before the sky, which mean all the fictions they say in their videos is stupid. It's a lie. Because according to science, the earth was very young compared to the universe. But in the Quran, the earth was created before all the stars and all the sky. Do you see it? Is that a Christian Prince translation? No. Is that a Christian Prince interpretation? No. As you see, this is the official government website of the Kingdom of Jordan. So they do their best to lie to you, hoping that you are a fool, so we can fool you. Good luck with that. You see, I'm trying to make the video short, but it doesn't work this way. Ah, okay. Uh, about, about the mountains. You see, when they say the mountain that Allah created the mountains, uh, they say, no, the mountain, Allah, he says, the mountain is Autada. Autada, it's a, uh, it have a root, right? The fact that the, uh, the word Autada is not a root. Autada is a nail. 
It's a nail. You know, the word autad is used for the nail you use. I don't know what the, what the correct word in English. Uh, when, you, when you have a tent, and you want to fix the tent down, you know what I mean? I don't know what they call that one. And you see the same word appear uh, many, many, many times in the Quran. Chapter 38, verse 12. Chapter 78, verse number 7. Chapter 89, verse number 10. If you click here, you will find the mountains as pages. And that alone is enough to explain that Islam is false. Because according to Quran, Allah, he dig the mountains in the ground. He fix it in the ground. When the fact the mountains are coming from inside the ground, not the opposite. You know what I mean? If you go right now and you search in Google, how the mountains is, form, is formed. How the mountains is formed. Let us see. How mountains. And this is, have nothing to do with the Christian, Jewish, Hindu. I mean, you can search right now. I'm, I'm not even going to open any article. I mean, just to click at images in Google. And you will find they teach you how. I mean, this is something we learn when in school. Even in the stupid Middle East schools. This is how the mountain forms. There is either a volcano from the pressure of the lava. Or the pressure of tectonic plates. So the earth is not a nail was put down in the ground. It is the opposite. Mountains are coming from the ground. In fact, their height increase. So do you see how stupid what they are saying? Because according to the Quran, and they are the one who says it is autada, and they say it has a root. The fact the word root there is not exist. The word there, as you see, it's a nail. And that nail is something you push down in the earth, not coming from the earth. So Allah, he put nails in the, uh, 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 the mountains as nails. If you go in the Quran, you will find the following, just to confirm more. <clears throat> Do you guys, you hear any noise of a fan or anything? It is a fan noise from your side. Let me know, please. You see a translation here, it says has firmly fixed, but in fact in Arabic it says Arsaha. Arsaha means he put it down. Let us change the translator. This is Yusuf Ali. Let us see a different translator. Go ahead. Let us see. Uh, which one we will choose? Karkut? What Karkut? Oh, this is Bos Bos Bosnia. Karkut. This is not the correct translation to it. You know what? Just to show you the correct meaning of this verse. Chapter 79, verse number 32. Let us go to the interpretation. This is the two verse after here. Just two verse. All right. Let us see what the Muslim scholars they say about. Here we go. Again, this thing. I mean, each time I want to open this website, my software give me a warning. Muslim website, what you can do. They think I am a terrorist now. Here we go. Read carefully with me. This is the Muslim's interpretation, not me. And has set firm the mountains on the face of the earth so that it stays still. So do you see the science of the Quran, how stupid it is? So the earth was created and then Allah, he created mountains as rocks and then he pushed it down in the earth and he in the face of the earth not down in the earth in the face of the earth so the earth will not move it's in the front of you let us go to the uh, to the uh, other miracle 
this miracle is not working it's a it's a fraud obviously maybe the second miracle will be good maybe you never know I mean we, we might get lucky tell us more uh, uh, do do let us move and see the one after what is the one after this one is one here expansion of the universe was described in Quran <clears throat> And it is we who have built the universe with our creative power and keep expanding it. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, Where it says we keep expanding it. Where, where the word it? Because when you say it, you make it go back to the sky, right? The fact in Arabic it says, Did not say, mention the sky at all. Said, we build the sky, we build the heaven. We build everything, and we can't even do more. There's nowhere the word expand is exist. Let us see if this is true or not. I mean, how come the Islamic interpretation for the Quran does not match with those miracles? You know what I mean? Chapter 51 verse number 47 do you, anyone sees here it says that Allah will expand the space if you go to the interpretation let us see the interpretation does it say Allah will expand the universe and by the way it is the Bible says a Bible a book written thousand of years thousand of years before Muhammad exists that God he extend the heaven like a curtain this is in our book this is in our book but nobody says oh, the, the Bible have a scientific miracle because we don't you know we don't believe in God because of science it's in our book but here nowhere it says what they are saying or what the Quran is saying that Allah he can do more let us see the interpretation chapter 51 verse number 47 And if there is a Muslim listening and he like me to put specific interpretation, I will be happy to put it. And you will see, he himself, he will regret. Uh, each time I want to open this uh, website, it's going to give me this message. Hmm. Do you see, guys? What is the word expand? How come none of those Arab who speak Arabic very well saw that there is expanding for the universe? Do you see anywhere? mean Allah is a strong do you see it he can do more he's a strong there is no expand there is no expansion nobody getting fat and nobody getting skinny and all of this is a lie hoping that because you do not know Arabic we can fool you and you shake your head because dude dude is shaking his head Ooh, ah, oof, ah, wow but as you see this is their interpretation why the scholar did not see the word okay how come in the Quran it says Allah will expand the heaven yet those scholars they did not notice they don't speak good Arabic maybe they don't you never know brother maybe those are uh, not Arab brother 